guys did i tell you that i'm trying to be better at everything that i'm doing ah, this is some breakfast that i didn't have time to eat today to be honest today i just didn't have time to eat my breakfast and i also had time to catch up i told you that i was gonna be in the gym for just one and a half hour so here's my breakfast i'm gonna eat it up before i go pick up my mail I'm doing overnight oats with um, a little bit of fruits and today I didn't have honey so I added a little bit of sugar and salt in it mm, amazing you just have to do what you gotta do Hi guys and welcome back to my channel i'm very excited it's a new week i'm very excited to be back it's a monday i'm into my third week or fourth week i'm not so sure back in the gym trying to keep it in the straight line but anyways today we are doing legs but before we jump into that i want to want to thank you for the last videos that i've uploaded for watching my channel for those who are old on my channel thank you for subscribing thank you for staying but if you haven't subscribed yet go ahead and subscribe to my channel and also give me a thumbs up if you like my videos anyways uh today's gonna be like days and i'm gonna be focusing on the glutes so we are going to go for the but first of all we're going to do our warm-up do not forget your warm-up very crucial very important and after that i'm going to do i'm gonna start off with the hip thrust I'll do the glute Gregorian split squats and then I'll jump into the squats, lunges and I'll finish up with the abductor, abductor machine. That's it for the exercise today and I only have one and a half hour to go. So without further ado, let's go. <laughs> Last week I used the machine that helped me out to do the hip thrusts but today i'm gonna focus on the traditional workouts so this is my setup and obviously i'm gonna start off with a 15 15 on both sides i think i can do that and of course we need like the protector i don't want to call it it's called a pussy pad i don't know why but before we jump into any other exercises let's start off with the warm-up let me be right by your side Cause I know that this is right I wish I just get to know me Gonna do some dynamic stretching We can take this somewhere else You and me can find ourselves Stop pretending we are lonely I'm 45 I'm doing a 45 second jump And I switch it out with the, some dynamic stretches I know you can resist Let me make your life easy the first round oh, wasn't that bad 15 in so let's try to go for the second round find the secrets you won't see let me be the one you talk to Alright, 
right, the next exercise is walking lunges and we're doing a set of 20 walking front and back and we're doing three sets of that. So, without further ado, let me pick up my weights and let's go. I'm starting off with a 10, 10, almost eight. I don't know if I can make it, but. It's gathering dust right now And the edges have been folded once or twice A little bit of information while we are working on the walking lunges, focus on the glutes. Uh, while doing this exercise, it's very important to focus on the wider stance and also keeping a neutral spine well bent. So in that, you're gonna feel it in your glutes, whereas if you're working on your quads, you're gonna keep a little bit of a neutral spine on a straight, more, a more straight level and also keeping a shorter stance. So I'm gonna demonstrate a little bit of that in the next exercise. So without further ado, let's go into our second set. As you can see, I'm gonna be doing a wider stance, a little bit bent, but keeping a neutral back and deep into my squat. Wide, two, Three, four, five, wow. into our third exercise and it's going to be the Smith machine that I'm gonna focus on but if you can do the normal if you can use the normal machine go ahead and use that but also here this Smith machine or the normal barbell squats can be used both to focus on the glutes and also on the on the glutes and also on the quads so it's very important to know what kind of form that you're using it's very amazing how creative you can be in the gym but I'm gonna demonstrate to you how this can be used I mean how I'm gonna do the squat the squat focus for I'm gonna show you how I'm gonna do the squats focusing on my glutes but also keep in mind that I'm going to be using a bench because right now I don't know what kind of level I'm on the last time I did this I was still using a bench so I'm gonna see what level I'm on right now last week I didn't do none of that so today we are doing that so let's go so it's very important to keep a bit of a wider stance if you're focusing on the glutes and going a little bit deeper and target those glutes most of the time most trainers will say that it's not important to go very deep which I actually agree with it's very important to focus on the glutes once you feel them drive a little bit up and that's sometimes you don't have to exaggerate the exercise so I'm gonna show you without the weights my bench is on an incline because I want to target on the glutes I want my glutes to sit on the bench and that's the main focus sit here and also it's very important to notice that while doing the squat focus of the glutes it's very important to keep your bar slightly at the back and also contract your shoulders not like this but right here in the sides and keep the bar straight on your shoulders that's in case you're using a normal bar but right now with the smith machine there's not so much technique to put in so it just sits right uh, and while doing the squats focus here but while uh, I mean while targeting the quads put the bar slightly here not on your neck but slightly here uh, uh, below your neck and while doing the squats for the glutes I would like to focus having my bar slightly on top of my shoulders so a little bit of a wide distance right and then you drive down and up down and up that's pretty much it without the weights I slightly feel like I'm targeting my glutes so that's it let's jump into the weights
we need a we need a set of 12 and i'm gonna do i think i will do four we i'm sweating anyways i think i'm gonna do four sets of that because that was a warm-up and then i'm gonna increase my weight gradually so yeah let's jump into the second set guys oh, i'm so excited for doing the bulgarian split squats obviously i haven't done them in a long time so with that being said let me come closer i don't think i'm gonna be using weights okay <laughs> please forgive me but ah, guys bulgarian split squats with weights right now i don't think it's very smart so let me just do with the body body weights and I said, as I said, in the gym, you gotta be creative with your exercises. That's because in case some machines are taken, in case some equipments don't, are not available, you gotta be using your imagination. So it's better to learn several ways to do certain exercises. So with the Bulgarian speed squats here on the bench, it's also a glute and quad focus, but it's very important to keep in mind how to focus on the glutes and the quads. But it's kind of the same concept, that's why I didn't jump into it after doing the walking lunges because it's a unilateral uh, exercise. So let's jump into it. I'm not so excited because I hate them, but I'm gonna use body weights and we're gonna do three sets of that. <sighs> gonna focus. On having a neutral spine a little bit of a wider span uh, a wider stance and all right let's do this Ooh. two three four bar is real <sighs> to be honest that wasn't that bad so i'm going to add on a little bit of weight i think i'm gonna go for a four that's gonna be a four on each side but if you want to be creative as i said you can use you can use weight on the non-working leg and then you can switch sides afterwards but i'm gonna see what i'm gonna work with either one weight or both weight let's see Just know that right now my glutes are on fire like yo it's ridiculously amazing how fantastic the pain can feel can feel so great can feel so great anyways i'm looking to the finish line i have only one exercise left and that's the abductor machine so let's jump into it we're heading for the last exercise of this uh, glute workout. Obviously, uh, I haven't done this exercise, the abduction. Remember, still creativity, oh, not creativity. You can use this machine with two exercises, either the ad adduction or the abduction. So we are doing the abduction. So uh, you want to stick your back here all the way to the, to the front to the oh my god grandson uh all the way to the to the end of the bench let's use simple english all the way to the the end of the bench and then you wanna have your legs at the last um step or the front step and then have a neutral spine bent Hold on to this, hold here, whatever you want, hold there, whatever you want. And then uh, squeeze up. Oh my god. Okay, obviously. I'll go that one. <sighs> Again. 
guys don't forget to subscribe like share and please click that notification bell button down below to be the first person to be notified when i upload new videos okay amazing job on us it's an amazing job on that strength workout that you've just done if you follow this video amazing and it's very important to stretch your body there's a lot of things that i'm changing when it comes to my workouts and that's including meals before workout uh stretching or warming up before my workout i usually warm up but about stretching after my workout something that i've been neglecting for a very long time but it's very important to stretch after your workout so let's do the final stretch and then we'll be up to go we'll be up to go Thank you for working out with me and it's amazing so see you in the next video don't forget to subscribe give me a thumbs up and also click the notification bell button down below to be the first person to be notified when i upload new videos so see you in the next one bye